Next question says, on several occasions up to now, Track has recommended that I increase the volume during day one of my pivot week. Since I'm doing the highest number of volume during these pivot weeks, should I still listen to Track and add an extra uh, set on top of everything else that's prescribed? What usually happens is that I have to reduce the repeat weights by 5% to do these Track recommendations and, uh, and all those sets due to fatigue from doing the prescribed ones alone. Um, I would say that you don't need to follow Track's advice in this case. Now, I know that this complicates things a lot, but keep in mind that Track's recommendations are just recommendations. You know, ultimately it's you that's the final decider on, on things regarding your training. So Track is recommending that you add some additional work because you're recovering very well. Now, if you know that the reason that you're recovered well is that uh, maybe you had a competition week last week, so, which is a proto deload anyway. And, um, you know, you competed, but you still feel pretty good. And yeah, now it's the pivot, but and the volumes are higher, but you haven't really started that training yet. You know that you're not going to still be feeling this good after that first workout where you have all those sets of 10 on your squats. So I would say in that case, it makes sense to kind of ignore tracks recommendation. You know, go ahead and, and do uh, your prescribed work. Now, if track came back the next day and is still suggesting that you increase the workload, then, you know, maybe you should consider it a bit more carefully. Uh, maybe you should put a little bit more weight on that recommendation. But it's just, if it's just kind of a one of, you know, it, it blips up that, hey, you should increase the workload and it just happens to be on this day where the workload's already really high, you know, you may say, hey, thanks, Track, but uh, I'm going to do it as planned this time. Um, so not, I, I don't intend to introduce too much complexity with the way that you interact with Track. It's supposed to simplify your training process, not, uh, not complicate things unnecessarily. Um, so this is one of those instances where I think, you know, Context is important, and it's important to exercise some good judgment.